Hey everyone, my name is Michael and welcome back to Terraria! Last episode, we fought the Brain of Cthulhu. Uh, oh, what was that? Okay. Um, in the Crimson Biome. And we explored um, the jungle. And as you can see, I explored a lot of the jungle as well. Um, off camera. Here. And I explored a lot of the ice biome. Now, um, I did it for a certain item I want to get, and that's all the loot chests, because I went for the ice biome, I got six chests, and one of them was the final item I needed, the ice skates. So, there they are, and then I got the anklet of the wind from this um, chest here, and the giant mahogany tree, and the underground jungle. Um... Yeah, and this is the ice chest. And the final item is, I think I have it in the equip. Hmm. Let me find it and come back. Well, I was a noob, <laughs> and I didn't even have the item I thought I had. Well, for now, let's just eat this. Eat, consume, use, I don't know. Just two life crystals. 400 elf is the maximum, as you can see, two rows of hearts. And yeah, I'll sort this and I'll come back. Okay, done. And there's a few things I would like to check out. So, first off, a blood moon happened off camera. Thanks, Terraria, for being a troll. And the bar, the bar keeper, I think, spawned. Um, he spawns as an unconscious man that you need to talk to and yeah he is we can talk to him and start the old ones army event which is probably going to be next episode so in the blood moon uh it's an event that can happen during the night um uncommonly and a few more enemies spawn and they drop the money drop now you know, we have a piggy bank here, we need to put some platforms and just put them in and then we have access. Well, fear no more, fear no more, because we have the flying piggy! So, yeah, that is just like amazing. We have a mobile piggy bank that we don't need to place platforms and, and do everything like that. Secondly, uh, we have light crystals. Now... Um, if I go to the materials chest, I think I have one, two, three, four. Um, and you don't need any crafting stations for that, it's just like anywhere. If you have life crystal, oh, and it's four chains per one? Huh. Well, I'll need to make some more chains. I need four, I need sixteen. Well, I already have eight. Actually, I'll just like put two in. And then ores and bars, it'll take one iron because it's one iron per ten per ten chains. So um you already can see items start packing up. But um yeah, we can make the hard lanterns which boost life regeneration immensely. And this is helpful with boss fights. I'm going to put this in our piggy bank just to have Okay, next thing. Oh, I, and I have some healing potions. Slimy! Demonic slimy. Okay. We have the jungle material. And now we can make the ivy whip. Whip, which is the best pre hard mode. Oh, it's the second best pre hard mode hook. And my god. It has three hooks, and then it has a fairly long reach, like slime hook. Um, it reaches for the tree. Uh, Reaches to the tree, and the ivy whip, which is way beyond that. So yeah, we have a new grappling hook, and um, we don't have enough jungle spores. Um, they are the most annoying part to get out of the jungle material. And yeah. So just before we start, um, I've created the second accessories and wings. I'm Making sure I don't have enough. Yeah. So, uh, wings is hard mode. 
is a hormone thing because I don't want to put everything in the accessories so I will give wings with second accessories because we don't have that many in the game just before we start the build for the dryad um, I would like to say that I grabbed the living gloom for another from another world because we didn't um, this world didn't have one and it's not a hundred percent chance from the living trees living wood trees and so I thought it it's all right it's just for for making the living um, living wood items um, such as walls and platforms I think um, it's okay if I grab it for another world even though um, this one didn't have it originally Wow, that took a long time, but I really like it. Actually, now that I think of it, I should add like mm, two of these along the way, just to have some light. And maybe, oh, I'm sure, here. So yeah. I went with the overgrown, overgrown feel, and that's what I wanted to do all along with the living bloom right here. Now let's move the door right here. Prefer house. This is not valid housing. What? What's the matter? Is it wall missing or what? Well. We can, oh, we can store things? Oh, that, oh, I didn't know that. We, you can store things in the dresser, so that's handy. We, we can change our style, so we can be like this, this, um, oh, we can change the style like this. I will stick to Torino's style, and, wait, what does it look like? Oh, that's weird. Okay, um, yeah. Hope you like it, it took a while, but I don't know why is this valid housing, it has walls, it has a light source, it has a table, is this, is this not, not counted a table, or, now will it be valid, no, hmm, well I'll try to figure it out and I'll come back. Okay, I know what I did wrong. 
you need to have at least one uh, block to stand on and I'm not sure um, yeah maybe I need to do this put the bathtub here no actually doesn't look right um, yeah no I want to access the oh that's cool you can access both yeah both sections now will it count as valley housing yes it is Oof, okay so then we can like oh mm, yeah we can like jump here and then run up to the dryad and yeah and then yeah we have the dried house Oof, and you can see the roots are like um in the ground there's tons of ducks i even heard the duck noise easter egg okay so i think today we'll be ch fighting two bosses at the same time okay uh, we're running out of time because we can only fight I have two in the day and in the night time. But let's get our let's summon King Slime, let's summon the Eye of Cthulhu and buff. Now I I can use my space gun because you know um I do consume mana now with Oh my god, okay. Um yeah. So let's do this. Uh the Eye of Cthulhu is a definite priority. Um, uh, we're out of mana, and I forgot to make uh, mana region or magic power. Mana region is more important, just uh, overall. And yeah, sorry NPCs, just walking through. Dryad, help me! Ah, uh, ah, uh, no. Okay, okay, okay. Um, let's use spiky balls. Let's use spiky balls here. Yes. Getting nice hits. Oh, the Alcatulu is transforming. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, I have Cthulhu is first priority because if it turns nighttime before um, we kill the I have Cthulhu, it will just despawn. Uh, daytime, not nighttime. Did I say nighttime? I don't know. <laughs> okay. So I think the spiky balls would help out uh, with the I have Cthulhu that dashes charges wow we have tons of defense that's nice oh my god Ooh, i forgot to put hard lanterns what are you doing okay i think we can sneak in a bunch of hard lanterns okay okay oof um hard lanterns no no i need them both um different why am i doing this okay now we have region Okay. 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 Oh, I have Cthulhu is down. Okay, King Slime is left. We've got the trophy. That's nice. If we can only get this King Slime trophy. Ah. Okay. I think we're winning here. And no, almost there. Just. Yeah! Woof! Nice! We beat two bosses at the same time. Well, our defense is crazy high. Like, warding, 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 and then the crimson armor. Uh, yeah, that was. Um. Um. Yeah, that was interesting. Ah, uh, okay. So, two bosses means two treasures. Okay. Uh, has the hang oh, fall damage. I still have fall damage. Okay. Now then. Time for treasure. I'll just clean everything up. Okay. Three, two, one. Bam, bam. Okay. <gasps> yes, we got the slimy saddle. We have the mount. Our first mount. Okay. Okay. Three, two, one. Bam! Yeah, now we have... We... Pff, fall damage. <laughs> now we have fall damage. Yeah, we have particles. Because screens in our room. Now, oof, we have the super high jump. Okay. 
super jump height and the regular stuff solidifier ninja ninja pants ninja pants okay um yeah I'll clean this up and i think we're going to find some sky islands okay now um for the sky island searching i am going to flip the entire screen so i know that it sometimes people get sick of it like get actually sick and um so just look at the minimap and don't f focus on the character that's what i do all the time it's even more efficient i will have shine and night owl just so you can see better and yeah um let's do this i'll take this and this and now gravitation potion now focus on this okay i'm going to go up so my screen is reversed now and um i'm going to go here wait i want to see oh no okay um yeah okay so this is the edge i think no what okay i think this is going to allow us to be more uh be faster with with the searching because well you can um use mounts while upside down but you can use it while you're right side up so um it helps um to just gain speed it's only a two minute duration buff the the gravity i don't think we'll find any um oh there was a harpy there oh oh yeah Woo. okay it's a sky island Woof. okay let's go um oops okay I will grab this, this, and this. Ooh, it's shiny red balloon. Now we can jump super high. And yeah. Now we can jump super high. And so um oops. We can jump super high and we can combine it with the clam in the blizzard in a bottle to make oh, there's a harpy again. Uh, to make um, an accessory that allows you to double jump and jump high increase at least maybe a little space but oh oh there's another one uh, okay Oof, it's a sky lake silence are nice um so it's either um island like with ground and dirt oh yeah and slimy floats too okay it's either this or sky islands we just islands in the sky you can fish and gravitation potion another one on let's see okay i think we should head back and try the other way okay In three two one bam uh there you go oh it's a sky it's a sky lake i prefer having i i want one sky lake on the world and then the rest sky sky islands regular with chests oh i ran out of gravitation oh, okay oh yes let's go oh oops okay Oof. let's go three two one bam star fury well i'm not sure oh um, mm, well it's a weapon that shoots from above so it's not that great of a weapon in caves and this is auto swing too so i'm not sure oh yes Woo! Woo -boo -boo -boo. lucky horseshoe for michael okay 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 woof 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 okay three two one bam yeah okay woof okay that's that's amazing now where is my rope i had rope in my head oh what okay now what i'm going to do is just do this and yeah until i get down there just so i have access to a sky island oh 
Okay, let's see if it's done. I think it's done. Um, okay, I can turn it. Oh, I do this. Nope, it's not. It's definitely not. And the game... Okay. And bam. Oof, that was a close one. Okay, now for accessories. I'll grab the cloud in a bow. Now, because we have... We can have blizzard in a bow with the shiny red balloon. And now, the white horse balloon. Um, I'll reforge it. Um, one gold. Arcane, brisk, crush, rush, spiked, jagged. Um, that's melee speed, jagged, rush, hasty, lucky, lucky, lucky is amazing. Okay. Oh, um, nah, okay. Okay. This is without any more double jump or rocket boots. This is the height. Now, let's see the height with the double jump. This is the height double, double jump. Now let's see with the rocket boots. The specter boots, sorry. One, two, three. Yes. This is amazing. Now we are mobile for height and vertical um, on and horizontal speed okay let's put the skyward chests there two three and then the water chest we got from the sky island okay yeah we obtained a feather um let's check what this does this makes demon and angel wings um that's both for hard mode as you can see souls of light souls of night and light well, 25 solo flight is expensive. Okay, we have gravitation potion. We can make these with feathers, blink with death wind, and fire blossom. And feather fall potion, which slow fall uh, with grants no knockback. But we don't really need it, you know, because we have our own knockback resistance. Put this back here. <sighs> okay, um, let's refill this. This can go. Oh my god. Material. And this is an ammo. Okay. Before we end this episode, um, I marked off camera these two spots. Now, I want to make a elevator, which is basically an elevator to hell, a vertical straight line that goes straight to the underworld, where, which we explored this. So, let's begin. Okay, mining's almost complete. Um, we've got most of the world. And just before we continue um, to the underworld, I thought, um, I saw we have lava and water attaching here, which create obsidian. Um, obsidian is super good. Uh, it creates hellstone bars with a hellstone or an obsidian. Uh, you make hellstone bars. And they are the best pre harmo bars. Now, um, I'll just get rid of the copper ore, I guess. Anvil. Don't really need it. Slash tungsten. Okay. Okay, uh, I accidentally clicked out of the game. Okay, so let's mine some obsidian.
whatever. And we've got tons and tons of obsidian. Don't think we need any more obsidian. Um, just um, throw away these glow sticks and let's go back. Ah, <sighs> okay. Let me just quick suck this. See, it's so nice. Tools and fun stuff. We have actually we can just. Um, go over healthstone. We have more obsidian than healthstone. Okay. I'll put platforms here. Just so we don't fall accidentally. Excuse me. Okay, obsidian skull. I'll just put it here. It basically grants immunity to these fiery blocks like um, the healthstone housing. These. And the meteorite blocks. They grant this grants immunity to the, the blocks and hellstone bars excuse me okay molten fury fire greatsword actually we can use the fire greatsword i think swords are pretty underpowered like um pre hard mode we can make a molten pickaxe very fast speed fast speed i think hmm i have to try to compare these but yeah, we have molten hammocks, and I three maybe I can make a sword. No. Um. Yeah, let's reforge the pickaxe and the hammocks. Um, forceful, no weak, no broken, damage, unhappy, heavy, annoying, sharp, murderous. That's plus speed. I'll take it. And this. Terrible, shameful, forceful, terrible, shoddy, mm, quick. Yeah, that's plus speed. Um, how many? I'm guessing it's 15 and like, oh, this is like end game. Um, it's 15, right? No, it's 20? What? Oh, that's a lot of, um, that's a lot of bars. Uh, for obsidian materials. We put water chest and okay I guess um yeah I'll just change this to above chest okay that's better and sticky glow sticks can stay okay well, let's continue mining. Okay, we're at the underworld, we have a straight, um, yeah, we have a straight line going from our base to the underworld, and yeah, we're flooding the uh, underworld currently, so that's a thing, and so yeah, let's get out of here, um, yeah, okay. Let's just quick stack everything. So we saw a marble biome, which is just like the granite biome. Um, there are counterparts. So, um, in random... Okay. Just a quick thing before we end this episode. Um, I forgot to add something in the dryad's house. Um, and I'll show you what. I had it in my inventory and I forgot. So let's go. Leaf wand. We have tons of falling stars. That's great. And yeah, leaf wand. Yeah. Now we can actually add leaf and yeah. And so let's just add this top here. I'll just put a torch f 
for now. Um, this is the face, and then I'll make it um, with hammer. Um, I done this before with hammers. You hammer um, leaves to make them look natural and and not like you build it. Okay, with our molten hammocks, we can hammer this once, this twice, this twice, and this like um, like this. And yeah, it looks more natural. Um, maybe like this and like this. Nah, this doesn't look good. Unfortunately, when you break leaves, you don't get any wood back. So that's that's annoying. Yeah, um, I can just make it look better just from hammering the blocks. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. Actually, I don't like the torch there. Okay. Also, we got from a bat the depth meter. Now this shows the depth. Currently we are surface to one to eight foot in the surface. Um, but what we can do is with our platinum watch, depth meter, and compass, we can combine those three to make the GPS. Now we have all three. Excuse me. Um, shows position, tells the time. So you can see position east, a hundred surface, one to eight, and time. Now let's check uh, with the guy what it makes. It makes the um, PDA. That's the name. It makes the PDA, which is combining all of um, all of the different things. So metal detector creates a goblin tech with with the depth meter, a DPS meter, stopwatch. Um, both are sold by the traveling merchant, and metal detector. Now. With fishing quests, you can also make the fish finder, and there's the REK 1000, which is um, which is required. Another thing for the traveling merchant, um, a radar from chests, um, wooden chest, and a tally counter tally from the dungeon from the dungeon. We can't enter it just yet. Okay, thanks for watching another episode of our Terrina Let's Play. We took down two bosses at once, built the dried a nice house, and we created our full hell elevator. Elevator to hell. It's a really um, important thing to have, just to get quick access um, to all of the underground, and I'll see you in the next one.